I will forgive your game literally anything <laughs> if your game is fucking sick. Like, if your game runs like shit, like, bad audio, graphics driver problems, like, I'll forgive it anything if your game is fucking sick as hell. All right. Uh, let's see. How many? Oh, we didn't check how many hours we're in. Uh, Pembino, thank you for the five months. Thank you, Pembino. Appreciate that. Uh, oh, by the way, by the way, hang on. Before this is this is my character. By the way, here we are. We're looking pretty stylish. I got a new sword as well. I don't know if you guys saw. I don't. Did you guys should take a look if, uh, if you've missed some parts of the playthrough. If you go on YouTube. I just recently uploaded uh, part two of Elden Ring on YouTube. You guys should go check out the thumbnail. <laughs> Or you should go check out the uh, the thumbnail for that video. It's pretty damn good. Uh, isn't performance an important part of a game? Absolutely. For the most part, the game has run pretty well. Oh, I'm actually, I just realized I'm fat rolling. It's run pretty well. Just occasional. I guess we'll take off the torch. Uh, I, I have some occasional dips in frame rate, but for the most part, it's run really well. Um, it's run pretty fine, so. Top tier thumbnail. Did we split? We still don't know how to open this chest. We still don't know how to do it. Uh, yes, I am playing on PC. Yes, I'm playing on PC. Okay. Uh, well, so if you haven't seen the world, uh, we went through this entire massive city and we went through the entire underground sewer area as well. Just like a crazy, like I spent hours there fighting bosses and you name it. We got up here to this also this like snowy, wintry, cold area, which I'm sure we're going there later today. I'm sure we'll be going there at some point. We also have this new sword, which we can't wield because we need three more levels in arcane. So I can't wield the sword right now. Um, we also have this sword. Check out this sword. This is a uh, it's a twin blade. We got it from killing a gargoyle. Pretty sick. Pretty, pretty sick. Check this shit out, man. <laughs> I found so many cool weapons at this point, man. Uh, we're going to have to go for the claws or something or other. These are these are my main weapon, but these weapons are... There's a lot of... There's, it seems like there's a lot of enemies in the game that kind of resist slash. And they resist bleed and shit. So um, I've had to switch off of them. Uh, a number of times. I kind of want to see... I want to go here. I want to go here. Let's go to Gate Town. Oh, hang on, hang on. Highway Lookout. Where is the Turtle Man? Where is Turtle Man? I can't remember. We have stuff to give the Turtle. Let, let's go here. I'm going to go here. And we're going to go that way. I think the Turtle Man's over here somewhere. You dig the Onion Knight cosplay? I'm looking for Turtle Man. <laughs> Not Mitch McConnell. So yeah, uh, I'm getting a little bit of chop, but maybe it'll be a little bit better today than it was. Let's go this way. You know, I also have a... Oh, there, there's a lot of chop right there. Well, <laughs> maybe it hasn't improved that much. Who's <laughs> in a church? Right, right. Oh, shnikes. These usually mean there's like a weapon here. Have I ever even, have I been here? I'm not even sure if I've been here or not. You want to throw down? Subscription. Ow. Okay. Well, you win. There we go. Usually these wagons mean some kind of weapon or something around. Uh, you were here two days ago. Was I here? Okay, I guess I did open. I guess I did open this chest. I don't think, I don't think I've been in there. Uh, okay. Ah, uh, Chiga, thank you for 11 months. Chef Bronson, thank you very much. It's such a huge world. It really is. Highway Lookout Tower. Such a huge world. 
kind of want to go back up to that lava area we were in yesterday. Or not. Well, I guess I, I don't know if that was yesterday. It might have been the day before. So we kind of want to go back there, too. But uh, how are you guys doing? How's your uh, how's your Sunday going? Hope your weekend is good. Uh, I think the same as you. I hope Elden Ring never ends. Yeah, I could just keep going and keep finding new bosses and new stuff. I could just keep going forever with this game. Yeah, I'm going to warp uh, here. I'm going to warp here. Cleaning the house. Nice. Been fun. Am I going to try to 100% this game? I'll try to, but I, for all I know, I've like locked myself out of stuff. Like, who even knows, dude? So there's this tower thing up here, and I'm not sure how to get into this tower area. Um, let's see. Roly poly, what's up, Honky Kong? Yeah, there's like this tower, and it connects to the other tower. See this one right here. I don't know how to get into this. Everyone wants to be Wolverine. <laughs> hey, these claws have been uh, have been pretty sick. So yeah, this tower, I don't know how to go, how to make it inside this tower. Is there like a door? Or something see like this tower if I, I i'm i know for a fact one of these towers a little choppy here i know for a fact one of these towers is going to have an entrance in the underground like i know for a fact you're going to come up and you're going to come up from the underground oh well maybe oh hang on is that the door maybe that's it maybe we found it it's all like kind of hidden on the side I kind of want to go back to the Academy today, too, actually. The uh, Rhea Lucaria Academy. I kind of want to go back there, too. Uh, I guess I never found this Grace. Okay, let's go. Touch Grace. Why don't you go outside and touch Grace? Resurrection Painting. So all these paintings are like, go to a spot, go to a spot. That spot really, really looked like this. <laughs> touch Grace, go find a maiden, go touch Grace and find a maiden. <laughs> hang on, hang on. Where's my, uh... okay, so this is the painting. This really looks like this, right? So that's, correct me if I'm wrong, but I just have to do that on the, I have to be on the other side of it. Like you see the tree, that tree there, it looks like it's reversed, right? Would that work though? Or I just have to go, keep going to the right that way so that it looks like that. Keep going that way maybe. Cause we're right here. Maybe we can figure this out. Hey, can I just look at it in a mirror? <laughs> So we have to keep rotating this until there. I really want to see what these paintings do. I really do want to see it. Painted from the other side. Oh, I found another orator wagon. Try jumping into them. Yahoo! <laughs> ba -ba 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 -ba. Let's go! Or is it maybe, you guys think maybe it's referring to this tree? Like maybe I have to be on the literal other side and this is the tree that's on the other side of it? Maybe that, maybe that's what it is. Have I killed all the enemies mentioned by Morgoth? Not even close, dude. I did kill Morgoth though. Does that count? <laughs> that counts. Yeah, his entire oh we found okay so church of Oz we found turtle pope greetings 
Uh, give a prayer book. We have a, we have a couple of prayer books. Give the two fingers prayer book. Very well. Heresy is all things can be. I would die for you, Turtle Pope. Oh, what have we here? Very well. Heresy all things. Okay. Swift glintstone shard. Magic Glint Blade, Carrion Greatsword. Uh, uh, Standing Yawn, thank you for the tier 3 22 months. Thank you very much. I really appreciate that. Thank you, Standing Yawn. To experience the miracle, kneel in the base. Absolution will be yours. Okay, so that's how. Okay. Well, we turned in all of our spell books here. Thank you so much, Standing Yawn. I really appreciate that, dude. We turned in all of our spell books. Um. Oh, wow. Oh, whoa, whoa, okay. Kind of running like poopy today for some reason or other. <clears throat> so. Let me try being on. what? So this is the academy. Let me try being on this side. I want to try being here. Let's go here. I want to try being on this side for the painting. My character is so large. First time you saw him, but you love Turtle Pope. Okay, well, this is the problem is that we're too low. We're on the western side of it, but... Uh, converted tower. I'm looking for a place where we could try to figure out the painting. I'm trying to figure out the painting. Have you been back to the Hurricane City place? Dude, I don't know what to do there. The, that area that area kicks my ass. I have no idea what to do there. Of course, it's raining now. <clears throat> What's up, Capster? How are you? Trying to figure out what we can do with the painting. We figured out how to get to the bottom left island. Well, it's kind of... Damn it, dude. I thought maybe we could do something from here. It's kind of it hard when it's... So it's kind of hard to see when it's raining, though, isn't it? Son of a bitch. Past time. Uh, can you, can you do that from this? I guess we could do it from uh, the grace here, right? Uh, Balrog, thank you for the gifts up. Thank you, Balrog. All right, I guess we can pass some time and see it's not raining. It looks like it's kind of be being a little slow today, isn't it? The game's running kind of weird. Kind of choppy. It's like it's running fine, and then all of a sudden it's like blah, 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 blah. all of a sudden it gets bad. All right, we'll try passing time. Hopefully the no more rain or mist. Okay, now it's mist. Let's go till noon. Okay, clear. No, is it? Is it? Is it? If it's still misty, I swear to God, I give up. Oh, okay, good. <laughs> I was gonna say if this shit is still misty. Okay, so let's look at the painting. That doesn't look right, right? That doesn't look right. You think that's close? I don't think that looks right. Maybe like a little bit this way? I think it's a smaller tree in the back. I don't think that's right. You want a copy of Elden Ring uh, donating to help Ukraine? Well, damn, congratulations. You think, I'm, you think I'm here? You think this is it? Let me get rid of these guys. These guys are a pain in the ass. Maybe on the hill behind me? So whatever Erd tree is in the background, it's either that one or it's this one, right? I'm beginning to think, okay, so let's look at the towers. The two towers, there's like kind of like a dome top and there's kind of like a like a taller tower, right? 
So if we look at this. It's hard to tell. I wish I could like look at it closer. Not right. I'm missing the two towers. It's backwards. So I feel like we're, we're on the wrong side. We got to be on that side. Maybe the other side. So what if we go here? Let's go back to the Church of Vows. God damn it. I, I can't figure this out. Ow, ow. I just fucking hit my microphone. Ow. Uh, Sauron the Almighty. Thank you very much. I'm... I'm wildly gesticulating and I fucking hit my hand on my microphone. There's a smaller castle to the left as well. Uh, okay. So this is this. Bridge gate was to see in the front. Okay, so if you look, I feel like this looks more accurate. I just got to like keep going this way. What do the dragon hearts do? Uh, if you turn in the dragon hearts at the church of the dragon thing, you get dragon abilities, which I haven't, I haven't been able to like use any yet. I haven't been able to use any. I might be able to use some now actually. Okay, so that's the gatehouse down there. So we're getting, I think, just keep going this way. That's looking more accurate, don't you think? Looking like a little bit more accurate. It's like closer. Do you guys ever feel like if you ever hurt yourself? Like if you ever like physically hurt yourself? You hurt yourself on the dumbest things. <laughs> the things that hurt the most are like the dumbest things. Yes, yeah, like, oh, you know, like you get like hit by a car and you're like, ah, I'm fine, whatever. But like you, you hit your shin on the bed frame and it's like it hurts for weeks. <laughs> like that kind of shit. Man, these those these archer enemies, dude. Okay, I don't I'm not even sure if I'm in the right area. Hmm. Shin meet trailer hitch. My uh my uncle long time ago. My uncle hit his, uh, he tripped on a curb in an airport and fell. And he, like, completely fucked up his knee. Like, utterly fucked it up. He needed, like, physical therapy, surgeries, like, just tripping on a fucking curb. Right? Okay, I kind of wanted to see something here. I don't know. Okay. Okay. Never mind. I still don't understand the function of these things. Sue the airport. I don't think it was the airport's fault. I think I'm pretty sure it was his fault. <laughs> and th this was many, many, many years ago. Right. You hit your knee in that just right spot. Yeah. the hell is that like giant rumbling here on another touch grace uh cross fortune thank you for the 28 months thank you cross fortune <laughs> bro did you just make it misty here come on we we're looking for something asshole we just make it cloudy by doing that hang on let's let's pass time and try to hang on let's go back and pass time it just got cloudy we're trying to figure out this uh this painting 
These paintings are going to be a, a pain in the ass to figure out. They're going to be a pain in the ass. What did I turn into Baron Harkonnen? This game is so cool. Yeah, all great. Now, now it's raining. Okay. What's up, Death Scythe? How's it going? It's still raining. Clear day? Okay, good. Welcome to Oregon. <laughs> Okay, maybe we're like almost there, right? Because the tree is kind of slowly emerging on the right side, which seems accurate. Okay. Yeah, it's like the game like is is being a little slow and it takes a second to uh to catch up once in a while. Uh I think I'm dead. Yep. We discovered if mimics exist yet or not. I haven't seen a mimic. I'm suspicious of every chest that I, I've come across. But there's been some that look like exactly like a mimic. Or like a Dark Souls style chest. So I'm, I'm suspicious. I half want to let one eat me. I want to let one eat me just to see what it like. If it's any different or looks any different. I'm, so if I ever see one and I like know it. I'm gonna, I think I might let it eat my ass. Like, you know what? Feast away. You may feast upon my ass. <laughs> or lewd. Uh, Alright, we got these. Fucking shit. Come on, man. Uh, if you're going down on these sideways gravestones, I think you just want to... You want to go normally. So, wait, we were... So, this is near the gates. Can I fast travel there, actually? Suicide. I don't know. Uh, it's yeah, it's here. Okay, let's just fast travel there. <laughs> you still think I'm too close? We can. Oh, well, we can back up as long as we have like the right angle. Like, we're more so looking for like the angle than like the location. We know what it is. We're trying to figure it out. Raining again. Get him out of here. More angle, less dangle. The claws are sick. Can't see shit, Captain. Yeah, no. Rain's, rain's definitely not helping our cause here. Uh, King, King Isaac, thank you for the five months. I'm fat Wolverine. <laughs> do the Wolverine claws make enemies bleed? Yes, they do cause bleed. Um, the bleed damage is, uh, pretty significant. The only problem is that not only are there some enemies that, like, they can't bleed, but they also, like, they resist the kind of damage we're trying to they resist slash I don't know where I don't know where this thing is I don't know where it is we're gonna find it though hmm. I don't know if I've been here Surely I must have, right? If we were just a little bit farther in that direction, maybe we'd be fine. What are we doing this morning? What is this mission? Uh, so we have these painting things 
And the paintings kind of show you a place on the map. And we're trying to figure out, like, what happens if you, like, line it up and you go there. It looks like we're so close to it. It looks like we're so close. What? What is this? I must, I've been here. Is this a great... Um, the dectum or whatever? I can't remember what this one is. It better be something good. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, so this is the grand lift of Dectus. Do you think it's from the top? Magma worm. It can't be from the top, right? You think it's from the top? West looking east, probably. All right, let's 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 travel up. Let's travel up. So we're gonna be looking west. <laughs> this world is massive. I didn't think it was here because it was uh, the edge. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. We're trying to. We're trying to figure it out, man. I'm trying to figure it out. What a death animation. But he still made it down either way. One of the rune, rune that makes you immune to fall damage. Okay, I don't think it's up here because it's like impossible to even see from up here. Like, I don't think it's, I don't think it's from up here. So I think it's back down here somewhere. Uh, Ranny's rise. Let's go to the Royal moon grazing gowns. Subscription. It's like the most inappropriate assignment anyone could give you. Okay. So this is where we fought the knight. Uh, I can't summon from here Man. I, I'm so like, I just want to figure this out. I really want to figure this out. Uh, angry red fish. Thank you for the resub. Thank you very much. Oh, wow. That's cool. It's cool that you can kill those guys and they'll give you like... They'll give you all manner of things. That one gave us a spell we didn't have. That's pretty cool. Hmm? If they end up being just pictures, at least you had some fun. Well, I'd be a little disappointed if it just ended up being a picture. Okay, this is looking actually where this is looking right. Does this look right? Is this looking kind of right? Okay, unfortunately it's raining. Get out of here. Uh, so we're in a graveyard. There's a cliff looking that way. There's some towers there. This is like it. This is it. It's like pretty much right here. Juvenile Scholar's Cap. Juvenile Scholar's Robe. Larval Tear. So we found some some armor. So this was the spot. This was it. This was the spot. What is the Larval Tear? Up. Excuse me.
Let's take a look. Uh, oh, so this... Larval tier. Material you needed by oh, so this is how we could if we wanted to respec, we could do it. We could respec with this now. Okay, okay, cool. So we got the armor and we got the ability to respec, and that's that painting. Okay, so we figured out that painting. This one's done. The resurrection painting. So this one says. So this is another one that says prophecy. The soul of the painter invested the dead's last moment can be discovered by visiting the location. So everywhere we go, we can like. It gives us something. You'll you'll like get some loot or something for that. Okay, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Uh Repidum, thank you very much for the tier three 30 months. Thank you, Repidum. Alright, neat. That was a that was a fun little scavenger hunt. Well, let's go uh let's go here. Where is it? The Grand Library. Let's go there. You got two messages too. So a respec means you can like completely redo all of your stats if you want. Art thou no? So we could do rebirth. Use a larval tier to accept rebirth. Now, bear this sweeting into life anew. Uh, let's see. With the rebirth, you can spend larval tiers to clear your levels and reassign them from square one. You must reassign all levels until you reach your present level, and you cannot make any attributes lower than their initial level determined by your origin. All right, so we have a lot of levels. We have we have to get 86. Let's put all 86 levels into vigor. <laughs> I don't think so. Oh uh, man, I wish I knew what. I wish I knew what took what. Okay, so this respec also allows us to... This is cool because it also allows us to see what we started with as well. So my dex was 35. And 35 dex. Did I need 18 arcane? Is that what I needed? I don't remember if that was what I needed. 17. Uh, let's see. I had 24 endurance. I had some mind. I don't really know if I care too much about the mind. That felt like kind of a waste. Uh, faith. We can put four levels into strength. Okay, I think we're going to go with this. And this means I can use the new sword. All we did was give ourselves the arcane and we lost two mind. So strength for dragon sword. Uh, we lost only one strength. Only one strength. All right, let's. Bell balled up. Okay, you can also uh, change your cosmetics anytime you want. Blood. Okay, uh, cool. Well, we managed to successfully uh, successfully do that. And now we can also wield the Morgoth's Curse Sword. Cool, cool. All right, that's a lot of work for an emote. That is quite a bit of work for an emote. Uh, Sugar, thank you for the six months. Thank you, Sugar. What is this on the map? You see that? What is that? I'm gonna go here. Let's see what that is. That's a lot of work. Yeah, let's go there. Uh, thank you, Sugar. World Serpent, probably. Alright, so we just got the new sword. I don't know if this sword is gonna be super awesome, but check out, like, so far, but check out the weapon art. <laughs> Look at that! Look at that, man. <laughs> Anime as fuck. Oh, there's your your speed up slow down there. It's been happening periodically.
Quick, let's take off all of my metal, my metal stuff. We're gonna get struck by lightning. Okay, always need somber smithing stones. We can jump up here, apparently. Uh, same as last time. Thank you for the 13 months. Ooh, cave? I am level 86. Level 86. We started off at level 1. We are now level 86. Ooh, piece of candy. Ooh, piece of candy. See, there was a, a hole we missed up top there. Ah, uh, here, let's go get this, uh, let's go touch Grace. <laughs> Roya Lucaria Crystal Tunnel. Okay, cool. You're half my level at 43. Magic looks pretty cool in Elden Ring. Would you consider doing a magic run? Uh, as far as I'm concerned, I may never play another game ever again for the rest of my life. You guys are a <laughs> funny joke, Barb. I, wa I wasn't joking. <laughs> okay, some cracked crystal. That wasn't, that wasn't a joke. All these cracked crystals are uh, a, a tool for crafting, but I don't know exactly what they're used for. Maybe they're more important for like magic crafting. You can't give up on Mario. He wouldn't give up on you. I'm sure we'll play more Mario. I'm sure we will. Just not for a couple of years. Time for sorcery. All right, how much damage we rock in here? Definitely, uh, this is a much slower weapon than a lot of my other weapons. Some somber smithing stones. Okay, okay. They do this shit behind there. You see that? Bro, they put some shit behind here. Fuck you. <laughs> they put some shit behind that. Hmm? Sneaky. Do I prefer fast or slow weapons? Uh, both can be fun. Both can be fun. Whatever you have to say about this playthrough, like whether I've like, oh, I've been, I got too distracted, like whatever. I have tried a lot of different weapons pretty much since the beginning. Been pretty much nonstop. I've been changing weapons. We've got a uh, club, spear, flail, uh, claws, this sword, like uh, dragon sword. I haven't used the dragon sword that much, but I've, I've tried like so many different weapons. <laughs> yeah, the black knife. Black knife was pretty good. Black knife was good. Okay, so this elevator does not work. Yeah, we also have the, the flail with the heads. Yeah, that's right. It's just standard squirrel oh shiny run. I mean, it's impo I feel like it's impossible to play the game and not play it that way. Whoa, look at this. Look at this platforming section. <laughs> no! <laughs> That's a hard jump. What are these jumps, man? Look at this platforming section. <laughs> Need to go back to Mario and practice. Unlock the double jump. Hmm? 
Kaizo player, by the way. Uh, probably if we wanted to maximize our damage here, we'd probably want to use the family heads. Let me try the family heads versus these guys. We wanted to maximize our damage here. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, I think the striking kind of damage does a lot more. And, uh... Oy! Hey, there we go. I did it. I did it too. The striking kind of damage does more, and uh, it's a higher level weapon. So, I'm going to make our lives just a little wee bit easier. Is that where it just came from? Okay, that is where it just came from. Oh, okay. What do I have on? Look, this is the ideal... This is the ideal form, guys. This is it. This is the ideal physical form. Peak performance. Oh, if you haven't seen this, by the way, check it out. So this is like th this. What I'm wielding is this guy's family's heads. And if I do this, I summon. I summon skulls to go after him. <laughs> it's it's not bad. It does pretty decent damage. Power of Grey Skull. Seems like a lot of smithing stones here. Was a, a long time ago, wasn't Smithing Stone 3 the one I was losing my mind trying to find? Wasn't it wasn't that the one I was losing my mind? So it looks like this this cave is like the Smithing Stone 3 one. So take whatever I'm saying with a grain of salt here because I'm still... We're, nobody's an Elden Ring expert. Nobody's like an expert on this game. Nobody has the knowledge. I've, I've been across a huge amount of the world. And I would say that like a lot of the world in Elden Ring. And to me, I feel like... Yes, it benefits you to focus one weapon. Hang on, let me wait for Gilbert. Yes, it benefits you to focus a weapon to make sure your damage is maximized, right? You want to have the maximum amount of damage at all times. Um, so yeah, that's obviously, that's always a good strat. However, there's been a number of different kinds of enemies that resist one kind of damage and are weak to another. So I feel as though, what, what, what's my point here? I feel as though the game kind of has pushed me to using like it's nice that i have multiple kinds of weapons is what i'm trying to say whereas like in dark souls 3 it's kind of like a one one weapon is pretty much all you need you know like having two different kinds of weapons and spreading it out has helped a lot if that is the case and i'm not just talking out of my ass if that is the case then that's really cool in my opinion that's really cool. Uh, Maze Haze, thank you for the 15 months. Thank you, Maze Haze. Right, like the incentivizing diversification of, of weapons. And how, how huge is this cave? Let's go down here. What, dude, what even is that at the bottom? That's the boss, is what that is. That's the boss. <laughs> I was like, what is this thing I'm looking at? That's the boss. different tools right so if like an enemy doesn't bleed it's nice and they have like armor it's nice to have like a striking weapon like this 
crushing, slashing, piercing are very D Dungeons and Dragons concepts. Yeah, that was in uh, that was in the muds I used to play as well too, where there were different and different armor types were more of a rock paper scissors. Right, more like the type of damage you're doing, like blunt versus like you can be dex, but I have a number. So like the family heads are mostly dex. And so is this, so are the claws, but they have, see this one says slashing and piercing, whereas this one is striking. You see the damage type up there? So that has, that has mattered. Dude, if I didn't have the family heads, I would have never killed Moog. I would have never killed his ass. You see how, did you see how little damage I was doing versus Moog? Whole lot of smithing stones. Uh, I think we know where this elevator goes because we were there. We saw the yeah that we saw the contraption that didn't work, so we we know this elevator. Okay. I have not found the dung eater. <laughs> I haven't found him yet. I don't know. I don't know where the dung eater is. We found a, we found a corpse that said it was a victim, like somebody who had been transformed by the dung eater. But I haven't found the dung eater. I can show you my my map if you want. If you want to see my map, this is this is how far we've been. And uh, I know there's maps over here, but I haven't been to these maps yet. But uh, yeah, I have no idea. I spent so long. I spent hours here yesterday. Hours and hours, dude. I don't like those guys. Hidden path ahead. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking asshole. Cassandra, thank you for the 1,000 bits. Thank you, Cassandra. I appreciate that. Ah, uh, thanks, man. Yeah, I saw on Twitter that you um, you started playing. I hope you enjoy it, dude. Is this your first like Souls-like game? Is this your first one? These guys firing multiple bows at you is fucking... That's so hilarious. It is? Damn, dude. Crystal knife. We found a new weapon. That's going to be... You're going to have a time. It's not going to be easy. What a huge, another huge, huge cave here. Oh, uh, I missed everybody. I came in trying to hit everybody and I hit nobody. Okay, well, if you ever needed stuff, this area seems like, holy crap, a really good area for stuff. Right here, the Roya, the Rhea Lucaria Crystal Tunnel. Oh my God. This place has been upgrade city. It's another elevator down. Holy crap. <laughs> Holy crap. Oh, shnikes. All right, fucking cowabunga. Let's do it. I fought two of you before. You think one of you is going to stop me? I literally fought two of you last time. You think one is going to stop me? I'm afraid it's not. 
Uh, don't we take the ball bearing? That goes back to the thing, right? Is this where we came in at? It is. Oh, you should have been here a long time ago. Yeah, the shop lady of Firelink. That's what we do with that. Okay. That was easy. <laughs> uh, all right. Let's see. Was there somewhere else? Hang on. Ooh, yes. Time for arms. All right, let's uh, let's go back here. Let's go turn that in. Uh, Gusta, thank you for five dollars. Thank you, Gusta. C, thank you for the seven months. Thank you, C. Loving the content. Even watched the vods just to be sure not to miss anything. Keep it up. Okay. Gusta, thank you for the five dollars. Anto, thank you for the tier. Th thank you for the tier three. Appreciate it. Thank you so much. Uh, thank you, Anto. Uh, it's Mr. Winter. Thank you for the eight, uh, the tier three, eight months. Thank you very, very much. I really appreciate that. So we can now buy infinite smithing stones. We can now reinforce all armaments up to plus three, plus six, plus 15. Uh, so that's all good. That's all good. Um, cool. Let's see, let's go to the upgrade area. Hell yeah. Where's the uh, blacksmith? Let's see if we can do anything here. Well, I took you for no matter. It's all lay out your arms then. The curly boy, she's crestfallen and can but she has a gift. I saw another eyes ship. Okay, so we can't level up the family heads. Can't do that. Uh, is there anything else we can level up? We need the somber smithing stone eight for Morgoth sword. Uh, we can't level up these. We need. We only need. I think I can buy a smithing stone six. Actually, I think I could buy one. I can go buy one right now. Uh, have I tried these Vihander? Uh, I, I do have a two-handed sword. It's not as Vihander, though. I think I can go buy a smithing, a smithing stone six. Offer rump. Yep, we can buy one. Go. Cool. The Gargoyle Twin Blade. Uh, I think I need more, like, faith or arcane to be able to wield that. I can't wield it yet. That one I cannot wield. Uh, RT, thank you for the nine months. Thank you, RT. Appreciate it. Back already. No matter. Okay, let's strengthen the claws. Okay, hook claws plus seven. Uh, they're plus seventeen now. Hell yeah! All right, we just made them a little bit stronger. Do the levels stop at ninety nine? Uh, I am. I can almost guarantee you they do not. I can almost guarantee you they do not. All right, uh, let's see. So where should we go now? I kind of want to go in this area to this to this area here and try to find the map. I'm pretty sure this is this is a map and this is a map. Kind of want to go there. Uh, or we could try to go up here to this lava area because there's a, I think there's a map over there too. You think? What do you think? Lava area or this area? What are you guys thinking? Feeling hot, hot, hot. All right. Let's go up here. Feeling hot, hot, hot. Lava sounds good. One of the two. Hey, coffee! Where's my coffee? This is bullshit. All right, let's go here first. Let's go re-equip uh, the claws. 
Mom! Meatloaf! We got some damage on us now. Yeah, we are, uh, we're kind of carving through some of these guys now, aren't we? Excuse me. There's a guy up top throwing lightning down at me. Ow. There must be a way in here, right? Yep, there's a ladder. My character is a funky looking guy. Uh, Oregon Torregon. Thank you for the 14 months. Thank you, Oregon. Snake Eater. Good morning, Elden Ring enjoyers. <laughs> Some fire arrows. I'm curious how good, like, maybe maybe I should be using a bow periodically. Who knows, right? What do we got? A pulley bow. Okay, wouldn't that be like, uh... Almost like a modern bow, right? With, like, a, the pulleys and shit on it? Is that the Kung Lao hat? The opposite of a pushy bow. <laughs> yeah, I haven't tried bows. I haven't. I've worked in a little bit of magic. Like, I can do some magic. You want to see some magic? Let's see. Bestial sling. Here we go. Come here, motherfucker. I'm going to throw rocks at you. Rocks. 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 Throw some rocks at people. <laughs> Pocket rocks. The bow is good in this game. Yeah, I haven't fucked around with it. I have. I mean, really, there, if you think about it, there's just an insane amount of stuff I haven't messed with in the game. So. Oh, man. Oh, these things are rough. Oh, no, it's okay. Thank you. So it seems like uh, scavengers curved sword. They have curved swords. In the lore of the game, those like amalgamations are like people who have grafted a bunch of other people onto them, right? Like they've grafted other people, other lords to their body for more power and stuff, I think. Uh, have I found any of the other Tarnish mentioned? Uh, yeah, yeah. We, we fought uh, the Moon Lady. 
And it's pretty much the only one we fought. Um, I haven't found any of the others yet. Oh, and Morgoth. Was Morgoth one of the ones mentioned? What? <laughs> what was that? What the hell was that? My God. Why are you here? Are you guarding something? Grass. Weird. Okay. Two of these guys in this corner was like, man, are they guarding something or what? Barb Wolverine. <laughs> Are these guys garden something? Volcanic stone. Yeah. Trina's lily picked you up. Those were like, those aren't even alive, dude. They're just dolls. They're literally just animated dolls with swords and weapons. Not even alive. And some more great arrows. How's the game going today so far? Uh, it's going good. We solved, uh, we figured out one of the paintings. I wanted to figure one of those out because I haven't done that yet. Uh, and we got, uh, we were able to respec. So I can wield a different sword now, which is cool. Let's see, where is it? There it is. Now we can wield this sword. It hasn't been fully upgraded yet, but it's really cool. It's got really cool weapon arts. Bro, these like volcanic bug things, these guys, they're awful, dude. Okay. Have you figured out the doors? Uh, no, no. The doors say you have to solve the puzzle. And I don't know what, I don't even know. It's hard to solve the puzzle when you don't know what the puzzle is. <laughs> <laughs> Solve the puzzles. Like, I'm sorry. What is the puzzle? I uh, haven't figured that out yet. Okay, we're getting closer. Just keep going west. I think that's, oh my God, holy shit, my ass. No, sir. Fuck that. What the hell? Volcano cave. Okay. Great name. Love it. It is goddamn dark in here. Well, let's see what we got in here. Uh, Dandy Kitten, thank you for the 24 months. Thank you, Dandy. Uh, yes, actually, we did get the rebirth. We actually did.
Actually, doing the uh, I didn't I had no idea, but doing the painting gave us the larval tear or whatever we needed. Uh, well, let's see what this is. Nope. What is a rebirth? The rebirth is like you get to respec and change your character's stats is what it is. Jar Cannon? Fire Great Bolt. Uses explosives to fire Great Bolts. Okay. Interesting. Can I, uh, I can actually one hand this sword. I don't know if I want to, but I can. Okay. I think there's something else here too. This game is hilarious. Respec again. No, I can't. I, we only, we, I think we consumed the larval tier. I don't think there's another one. I'm pretty sure there's not another one. I, I, I'm pretty sure there's also more in this cave. the moonlight greatsword in this uh i'm sure that there is some equivalent in the game to the moonlight greatsword uh that doesn't mean i found it i haven't found it yet i'm kind of uh i'm so oh wrong thing i've got pretty heavy armor on i'm kind of poising through a lot of these hits that might be the armor Coil shield, sliver of meat. Read message. Praise the bright spot. Hmm. Is that it? Is there anything else to do in here? Is there fat rolling in this game? Definitely. Yes, there is definitely fat rolling in this game. You are eating human meat. You got a human meat guy, Frank? So this is where we fought the boss. Another a little long pig. Anywhere else we could go? String. Precious item ahead. <laughs> Assholes. 
Assholes. Uh, I think that might be everything. I think that might be everything. In, the, in this cave, anyway. Uh, okay. Let's uh, head back up. I think we, we kind of went through this whole area. You just see a volcano in Volcano Cave. Surprised at the lack of lava. There is lava here. Uh, we fought a fire dragon thing that came out of it. Where there definitely is lava. Volvagia, yeah, something like that. Hang on, let's grab this real quick. Thank you. Yeah, the Salamander thing. We've actually fought two of those now. Okay, so apparently we've never touched we've never touched this grass before. So I could jump up here with the horse. I could. But I mean... Visions of snake. <laughs> All right, hang on. All right. Well, <laughs> this thing, uh, this thing does not look nice. Oh, God. Full grown falling star beast. Change my weapon. this one I thought maybe this would do more damage it doesn't thought it was gonna do more damage damn it I'm killing myself because I keep changing weapons <laughs> I keep changing weapons yeah the sword was better I thought I mean it looked like I thought strike was gonna be better versus this thing I think you can understand why Oh, this thing is kicking my ass so far. Ow, dude. Oh, this thing's an asshole. This thing seems tough. This thing seems tough. Rain seems like it's good. I wonder if it takes more damage in the head, like the, the head area. Okay. Are they really? <laughs> really? Oh, I guess I don't have to climb the ladder every time.
Well, it seems like it definitely takes more damage in the face. Killed my horse. Bro, I was like, I was running as fast as I could. I couldn't get away from it. Bro, excuse me. Excuse me. Ah, uh, he immediately killed my horse again. What in the world was that? my horse again. Boy, this thing is such an asshole. God, this thing is a fucking huge asshole, dude. How do you avoid that? How on earth do you avoid that? Man, this thing is ridiculous. This thing is fucking ridiculous. I'm gonna kill my horse again. Get him out of here. Get him out of here. Holy shit balls. Holy shit. That thing is a douchebag. Falling star beast jaw. We got a new weapon from that. Holy crap. A rollies, man. Ha <laughs> ha. 
Look at that, dude. Look at that, man. It says gravity bolt. You can fire some kind of gravity bolt with this thing. Wow. Cool. There's so many damn weapons. So like these things like literally came from space. It says star, right? These things are actually just straight up from space. <laughs> Seems like those things are from space. I think we'll be everyone's best friend in the randomized. Dude, those things are assholes. Those things are fucking assholes, man. Uh, okay. Well. That wasn't why I came here. A little choppy here. So many bosses and weapons, this game never ends. Uh, that's the best part about it. I hope I hope it just keeps going for all eternity. Okay. I think that we just got another uh, Estus flask. I think. Pretty sure we just got another Estus. Hmm? Uh, my power got cut. I assume I killed the thing. Yes, I killed the thing. Uh, it it pff, that thing kicked my ass, but we killed it. There was a place over here where we could touch Grace. How am I supposed to hit this thing? There, God, finally. <laughs> finally. Subscription. Didn't we see some grace around here? I thought I saw grace. Is that a Korok? Uh, so those things can drop various Ash of War. I feel like the Ash of War is something I have very, very underutilized so far. Something I haven't, I haven't looked at much. I really thought I saw a, gr a grace point. Oh, oh, no, that's not it. Did I imagine it? Was it my imagination? What was it up? Maybe it was the fire. Maybe I saw the fire and that was it. Missed the bowl. I thought I saw one. There might be like a respawn point or something here. I was just, I thought I saw a grace. You saw glowies next to the tree. Uh, the boss fight made me delusional. Yeah, maybe. The boletarian. Oh, well. a little choppy there. Are you exploring it? Did you beat the game? Uh, I haven't beat the game yet. No, I, I, I hope I don't. I don't want to beat the game. Boy, look, this castle looks fucking huge, too. I don't want to beat the game. Okay, let's, uh, let's go in. Let's go in here.
May, make it never end. A hundred hour playthrough. We're like uh, 30 some hours into it. Okay, well, we finally found a grace point. Volcano Manor. Uh, Tyler Swank. Thank you for the 21 months. Thank you, Tyler Swank. Uh, what does my weapon even mostly scale with at this point? Dex, endurance. Grab some more dex. Uh, oh, we need five golden seeds. We need five golden seeds. Okay, before I go in here, we're at Volcano Manor. Let's double back and let's go try to find that map. Uh, Nagi Boy, thank you for the 16 months. Thank you, Nagi Boy. Uh, it, dude, it's already going on YouTube. It's already on YouTube. Uh, parts one and two are on YouTube. Uh, you can check it out right now. I want to find the map. We learn about we're going to learn about the T virus. We just might. We just might. It's a big hand. Map, Mount Gelmir. Okay. A new map has been added. So we just got the map of the Mount Gelmir area. And uh, this is where we currently are. And we were going to Volcano Manor. This is where we are right now. We we're going to Volcano Manor. Okay. Subscription. I'm the map. Uh, Shade Shane, thank you very much for the uh, 50 months. What does this guy have to say? Lord Rickard. In this putrid field of death is what your blasphemy would bring that I can no longer abide. No one can. The dude abides. Oh, guys, check it out, guys. Could it be? Could it be? It's a worm face. This time he's not a boss. <laughs> it's, it's worm face. <laughs> oh God, that's death. Oh my God, that's death blade. Oh my God. Worm face! <laughs> How romantic. That, uh, that death blight he was spreading, man. That actually... Bro, we can actually, you know, it's funny. That's another respec. We could respec again. That's another larval tier. <laughs> we could actually uh, respec again if we wanted to. Before you say it, I am not respecing again to use the cannon. No, I knew there was going to be somebody. I knew somebody was going to say that. I am not doing that. <laughs> I knew there was going to be somebody. No!
Oh. Sometimes it's weird, like, you see these little enemies in these off corners, and you're like, what are these guys protecting? Are these guys guarding something? What if somebody donates 50 subs? Would you do it? Uh, all I would need is a lot more strength to use the cannon. That's all I would need. Is this like a burnt out Erd tree here? What is this? You know, being mounted is great until all of a sudden it's not. Oh, man, that hurt. Ah, uh, I mean, I tried to dodge it, just didn't do it. Here I am just running after this thing with my sword. Don't you do it. There we go. All right, what do you got? Whoa. Leaden hard tier and cerulean hidden tier. Uh, okay, leaden hard tier. So, uh, eliminates all FP consumption in mixed physic. So if you drink it, it eliminates the usage of FP. What was it? Harden leather, harden something? Leaden temporarily boost poise. Okay, so we could boost our poise with that too. Okay. Interesting, interesting. Do you see that move? He runs at you with the one thing raised and then he stabs you with the other thing. Did you see that move? <laughs> Did you see that? That's awesome. Uh, I don't know what's down there. I don't know what's down there. Let's go find out. What does this say? Stay calm. Grass. Try jumping. The 
four oh dude i love the four-armed archer that enemy is so cool hey we got another stone shard key okay always happy to find those Corpse, sten corpse Stench Shack. How do you like this weapon? Uh, this sword. It seems pretty good. Uh, I think any weapon that causes bleed, you want something that strikes fast and multiple times. So this weapon as a bleed weapon is kind of, it's kind of, it doesn't make as much sense as something like the claws, right? I'm having fun with it. I'm having fun with it. No, I need more of the special keys. I definitely need more of those for sure. No, we just unlocked Volcano Manor. I got distracted going for the map. And uh, now I'm not even sure. <laughs> now, I'm, now I'm just... I went off this way. First, I got distracted by the boss, and then there was another boss. It's just like a constant, constant string of distractions. <laughs> I am going to go back to Volcano Manor. We are going back there. And then another boss. Yep. How could you get distracted in this game? Apparently, I already found this one. You ever go back to the four belfries? Uh, yes, I have. Do you see this area? What is this area? Let's go back to... Uh, I don't know what that area is. Let's go back to Volcano Manor. And let's go through Volcano Manor. I want to see this cool thing. I mean, it's just... It's a game where it's easy to get distracted, dude. You found this Y-hander to use or not to use is the question. All right. So we had just got into Volcano Manor. Aren't you precocious? We rarely receive visitors to the Volcano Manor without invitation. Fascinating. And not unlike another guest we had long ago. So tarnished. Have you ever harbored doubts about the burden of grace and the dogmatic ramblings of the fingers? If you have, why not join the Volcano Manor and fight with us, rise with us against the Erd Tree? Join Volcano Manor, don't join. Isn't that what uh, the chick wants us to do? She wants us to burn the volcano, burn the tree. Well, now, let this intersection of our path. So we did not join. What's this? Have you reconsidered of rising with us? Very well. Your decision is now you belong to the, the drawing room lies down the hall. Drawing room key. So that gave us a key. Okay, interesting, interesting. I hope I didn't make like a really bad decision with that. <laughs> Door is blocked shut. I hope that wasn't like a really bad decision, but I guess we'll find out. This is like a branch in the story. Yeah, hopefully not. Okay. If it was, you know not to do it on your next playthrough. A pleasure to meet you. I am Raya, the scout. Very pleased to welcome you to the Volcano Manor under Lady Tanith's guidance. May you tread the path of valor. Brave Tan under Lady Tan. Okay. You. What in heaven's name are you doing here? The Volcano Manor is a pit of recusants who spit at grace and hunt our own kind. I hope you understand the... Well, as long as you and I thought you were tarnished. Perhaps playing that part led you to your... But know that the path you walk is blast. Before you consider hunting any of your own kind, think on that. 
Okay, this sounds a lot like uh, Covenant. Covenant and invading other people and going after other people. Well, nice to see you again. So you've been invited as well, I see. Then we're comrades in arms henceforth. What was the letter from Volcano Manor? What was that? Uh, I don't know where to... F oh, here it is. Uh, a written request from Volcano Manor disclosing the name of a tarnished to be hunted. Old Knight Istvan. He can be found in Limgrave. Find the red mark on your map for uh, the exact location. This is like almost like uh, like a Dark Brotherhood situation where it's like go hunt this guy down and kill him. That's kind of cool. The serpent slaying spear in the Lord's chamber, worthy tarnished, the great serpent. Okay. Hidden path ahead. Fuck you. There's no hidden path. <laughs> you can't take me serious with this outfit. Fuck you. I'm uh I'm like a Mexican Siegmeyer. I'm Fernando. <laughs> We sure, Barb? Ole! Viva, bitches! Don Fernando. <laughs> How many? Uh, I have 38,000. Okay. Uh, up we go. Let there be jump attack. Smithing stone. Uh, invaded by Inquisitor Giza. Get out of here, you old Giza. What the fuck is this shit? <laughs> oh my god. This one causes massive bleed too. Well, we gotta go respec again, right? Now we gotta go respec again, obviously. <laughs> oh, gotta go respec again. A singular strike. So is that all there is to do here? Ooh, piece of candy. I think that might be it. Ah, fire. No secret ahead. Hmm. I don't see anything else to do here. I thought this was going to be like a huge area for us to like, you know, investigate. And like, I thought there was going to be like enemies and bosses and shit. There was a room I opened but didn't enter. Was there? Did you read the letter? That is the task. The you will be compensated once the deed is done. If you are loath to hunt your own king, but you must leave this house. This is a war against... We have no place for the meek, nor the luxury of... So these people are trying to destroy the Erd tree. Uh, where is the Lord's chamber? He left the spear. I don't remember. We can talk to this guy again. Uh, no, actually we can't. He's gone. <laughs> uh, no, actually I can't. He's gone. Snake? Snake!
don't know, guys. Door is blocked shut. I don't know. Maybe there's not. I guess there's nothing else to do here. I thought we had to go here. Maybe there's nothing else to do. Three of them said hidden path. I um, I can tell. You're wondering about Lanya. Well, you see, I, after much internal debate, I've come to realize revenge is not the answer. According to Lady Tanith, I've got the stuff of champions. And champions, ironic as it is, are oft forced to walk a tainted path. It hit me like a bolt from the blue, that my former thoughts were simple naivety. Of course, my heart weeps for Lanya. That unfortunate incident was a cruel. But succumbing to the pain and sadness caused... Lanya knows this, I'm certain. Fate has laid hard roads for us, but such is true of any road trod by... All right, I don't, I don't know where else to do. Did, 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 I, did you guys see anything that I missed here? Can I open this? God damn it. <laughs> you think there is a hidden path somewhere? There's a door there that doesn't open from that side. There are places to go. Well, I don't see where to. I don't see where to look. You can't. So I'm. You can't attack here. By the way, if you're wondering why I'm not attacking, it's because I can't. Did you hear that? <gasps> Bro! It's a snake snail. If I... Sometimes I really want, there's times like I have a torch and a lantern and there's still times in the game where I'm like, man, really want some more light. Tunnel ahead, thanks. I still don't have enough light. Can I, uh, let's see, man, just that little bit of extra puts me over to a heavy load. God damn it, dude. Go cure the poison here. Okay. Share the load. Bro, how fucking cool is this game? Nomadic Warriors Cookbook. How fucking cool is this game? So that secret wall, you have to roll into it to find it. You can't attack. You have to roll into it. Oh, I really am, dude. I, I haven't had this much fun playing a game on stream and since since Sekiro and that was you know I, I I don't know I've just had an insanely fun time I want to go home time for ranged battle
Man, that thing was an asshole. Bloodhound Claws. Is this a new version of Claw? There's another Claw weapon we found. Uh, I guess maybe they do a little, maybe they do a little bit more damage or something. They have a different skill. Become temporarily invisible while dodging at high speed. <laughs> We got the anime claws. <laughs> okay, cool. Want some more grace? Okay. Nothing personal. Shinobi art. Yeah, right. I think we could probably level up. We're really close. Uh, Jupaloop, thank you for the 44 months. I'm sorry if I haven't, if I, if I miss a sub, I, I'm sorry. Thank you very much. Let's grab some more endurance. Is this going to take us back to the, to the entrance or are we somewhere else? Okay. We are somewhere else. Whoa, dude. It's so cool, man. <laughs> Oh, man. Bro, where even are we right now? This game, I'll tell you what, this game likes its dogs, man. This game sure likes its dogs. How does one hidden wall lead to all this? Maybe there's like, maybe it's not just one hidden wall. Maybe there's like multiple ways to get here and we just don't know about it. Let's go back to the uh, claws for a little while, I think. Son of a bitch, man. Oh boy. Reminds you of Near Automata, or oh, the giant claw thing. Uh, well, we have uh, we have plenty of keys. We have plenty of them. Yeah, use it. We've got plenty. This is my reward. Uh, Jignar, thank you for the resub. Thank you, Jignar. What do we got? Crimson Amber Talisman. 
What is that? Greatly raises maximum HP. So this one raises my maximum stamina. This one raises my HP. Okay, let's keep in mind my HP. We're going to line it up right with the torch and we're going to equip it now to see how big it gets. Greatly raises maximum HP. That's a pretty significant amount. That's a pretty significant amount. Okay, I'll take it. Pizza time. The claws are no joke. Yeah, I like my claws a lot. They're a good weapon for sure. I have the I have I have a number of different weapons I switch between. I, I try to use them situationally. Um I know that in, in the Souls games you're often rewarded for really focusing on one weapon. But uh yeah, I, I just can't I I feel like I can't help myself. I can't help myself. Uh, Dr. Shmoo, thank you for the 24 months. Thank you, Dr. Shmoo. Uh, Skeptics, thank you for the uh, 100 bits. Moonlight Sun, thank you for the 24 months. Thank you very much. I really appreciate that. Nice, guys. The Peen Snake is back. Are we calling it the Peen Snake? What's up, Jade Foxy? Thank you. Uh, another smithing stone. Okay. Albanark blood clot. I'm a grower, not a shower. <laughs> uh, no, it actually goes beyond plus 15. It actually goes beyond that. Hey, asshole. Do I think this is the best game of the Dark Souls franchise? Well, it's not really part of the Dark Souls franchise. And I know I know that that's hard. It's, it's its own thing. It's just like how Bloodborne is its own thing. It bears a ton of similarities. There's obviously a lot of inspiration, but I really think it's better to not think of this as a Dark Souls game. Now, if you want to say, is this the best From Software game? Uh, then, uh, that's, that's a more accurate question. I, I can't, I haven't finished it yet, but uh, this game, this game has exceeded all expectations and I may even like this. I, I'm pretty sure I like this more than Dark Souls 3. Uh, I may like this more than Sekiro. I, I don't know. I don't know. I think that the raw combat mechanics of Sekiro... I maybe like better just because of how satisfying the Sekiro combat really is for me. But uh, in terms of the world, the exploration, the, like this game has way more variety than Sekiro does. Thank you, baby. In Sekiro, you pretty much, you have one weapon. Oh no, I was talking. I didn't even see this guy. Stop eating my face. Okay, okay, sorry. This is what I get for stopping for one second to talk to chat, huh? This is what I get. Okay. <laughs> Man Serpent Shield. So, I think that maybe the raw combat of Sekiro might be more satisfying because I love the... I love the parry, dodge, makiri. Like, I love that. 
And this game is definitely more like Dark Souls, where there's like rolling and jumping, but that's pretty much how you evade most attacks. Like maybe Sekiro's raw combat mechanics against like a one-on-one -on -one enemy are better, but this game has like an infinite more variety of builds, weapons, like skills, things you can do that will just like, it'll, it, it just will make Sekiro seem very simplistic by comparison. So they're different kinds of games. They're different. They're different. They have different goals. Um, the world of this game is is way bigger than anything in, in Sekiro as well, too. So. Okay. If you wore the turtle shell on your back, you'd be a perfect sphere. <laughs> Good point. Jumping required ahead. Try jumping. Something incredible ahead. Visions of rats. <laughs> the fuck? I wonder, are these guys covering me in oil? Like in Bloodborne, where if I get hit by fire, I take more damage? I'm not sure. I'm not 100%, but it kind of feels that way. This place is huge. The hell was that weapon? See that shit? It was like a tail, like a chain sword. Okay, can't summon the horse here. Ah, oh, great. One of these assholes again. Man, I... Really hard to fight this guy. Really hard to fight this guy in this tiny little area. Boy, these things are tanky too, aren't they? In case you're wondering where I'm going, I have no idea. So just in case you're like, where's he going? I don't know, dude. I don't fucking know. <laughs> I have no idea. What's he doing? 
I have not a goddamn idea of where I am or where I'm going. We're on the same page. Good. So it seems like, okay, here, here's a, here's a side question for Chad that doesn't really have, it's not really like a spoiler kind of thing or anything like that. It seems like the ending is pointing us toward either destroy the tree and like destroy the Erd tree and, you know, stop, like destroy the world kind of, or become the Elden Lord and like preserve. So like. Is there one that seems like clearly bad? Like, so these people seem very anti-tree. These people want to destroy the tree. These people seem like they really suck. These people seem like they're evil and shitty. Like, it's all decayed and ruined. Like, I don't know why I would take these people's side, right? I don't know. These people seem like they suck. Trees are evil. This area almost seems... Yeah, waifu wants to destroy it. Yeah, she does. Well, maybe she wants to destroy it for different reasons. Because she's trying to do something and these people are trying to do something else. Uh, okay, I don't see where to go. Oh, I do see where to go. There's another elevator here. Okay, interesting. This, so the one goes up and one goes down. Which Rani is also anti tree and she was nice. That guy's gonna kick my ass. <laughs> Some more smithing stones, good. Feel like Treebeard be the entry can be bad and their people can be assholes. Have we met any tr pro tree people? So the pro tree people are the fingers and the, the tree is what's, or, the tree is what's leaving around the grace, right? And the fingers are determining the divine grace, right? So we're, when we're using the grace, we're using the things left by the tree. Man, I like the way his spells look. Do you see his spells? Have I had any performance Trinket issues? There's been some frame drops and some weird stuff, yeah. Blood. But uh, it's... I mean, the game is incredible. I'd give it, like, maybe, like, a B for how well it runs. Like, the, the performance of the game is not its strongest aspect right now. Uh, I think that there will be future patches that will probably fix it. But yeah, there's definitely been some issues. Are the yeah, it's not it's not the PC, it's the game, yeah. Uh Renato, thank you for the tier three 12 months. Thank you, Renato. I appreciate that. Thank you so much, man. Uh Mr. Combustion, thank you for the 21 months. Thank you, Mr. Combustion. What the fuck are you?
couldn't let me get one more hit, could you? Just couldn't let me get it, could you? Just couldn't let me get it, could you? Unreal. I had him, too. They just couldn't let me get it. Uh, where the hell am I? <laughs> okay, so it was... This way... This way, I think. Fucking son of a bitch. You can do a long compilation of me dying to bosses when they have like 1 HP, 10 HP, like a long, long video compilation of that. Uh, Giraffe Killer, thank you for the 46 months. Thank you, Giraffe Killer. That belly, the belly attack, dude. Who kills giraffe? Maybe giraffes are huge assholes. We just never knew. Maybe giraffe, maybe his family was killed in a stampede of giraffes. Can't believe they got Chat's mom for mocap. And he stabs right through the walls. You know, I really like when fights in these games, even though he's stabbing through the walls and it's kind of bullshit. I do really like when fights in these games have like some kind of pillar or something. I feel like it gives you like a more strategic boss fight overall. Okay. Like, is he gonna stop? had him first try survived by like one hp god skin stitcher and noble presence so we just got a new weapon it's like a rapier a heavy thrusting sword uh and impaling thrust so this is the new sword Ooh, what a sword what a sword that's cool. I like it. Neato. Like a super stabber. I like that. That's neat. Very cool. You know, Lord, don't look, you know, who even knows if it's good or not. All right, let's go back to my uh, Morgoth's Cursed Sword. Who even knows if it's good or not? There are a lot of bosses in this game. Some bosses are repeated. Some bosses are definitely like repeated. But never to a degree where I like resent it and I don't I don't mind it. Serpent's Amnion. Key item. What is that? Anybody see it? Our blind middle? I don't remember what it looked like. 
<laughs> What's it? Top, middle. Top, middle. Up, down. Like a football? Is it Serpent's Amnion? Oh, here it is. Amnion from a womb that bore unintended offspring. Uh, it will never dry out, remaining damp indefinitely. I don't know what that is, but okay. Cool. So this takes us back outside. This looks like there was like an elevator here. Forever moist. Uh, I've been kind of going a dex route. Yeah, we're 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 kind of dex this this build. Golden rune. It does seem like a. I, I will say that a lot of really cool weapons I found early on were like all strength. Like, a lot of them were, like, all strength. So that was kind of like, uh, man, kind of wish I'd gone strength. I think it's kind of tilted back the other way now. We're getting a lot more dex items. Okay, this seems unusual. Why is this here? Is there somewhere to go from here? Looks like we could uh, jump down here. All right, we're jumping down. You guys think Luigi's behind here? Go behind the waterfall. I don't think that's water, dude. Let there be confidence. I want to pick up the item. It's over, Anakin. I have the high ground. You underestimate my power. Can I make this thing go in the lava? I don't think it's going to go in the lava. This lava looks good. Fuck you. <laughs> Fuck you. Before you ask, nope, still have no idea where I am or where I'm going. Range attack. Oh, there was, dude, there was a place we could get off the elevator. You see that? It flashed by real quick. Oh, okay. So we're back in the church where Blob where Blobby was, and apparently there was a shortcut here, and we just got it. Okay, didn't I didn't even know it was here. You get lost like two hours ago. What is this new weapon? Uh oh, hang on, it's right here somewhere, right? I uh, know, maybe it's the other side. Yeah, it must be the other side. Uh, this is a boss weapon from killing, uh, I forget the name of the dude, but, uh, rest assured we killed him.
Morgot. That's it. Morgot. Hey, always happy to get those. Bro, how fucking sick is this? My god, dude. How fucking sick is this? Someone is having one. What's up, Oni Girly? How's it going? Have you done many stone sword areas? Every time I find a stone sword door, I open it. If I don't have a stone sword, I'm like, no, man, come on. Like, I'm like really upset every time I can't actually do it. The only thing I haven't found more of, aw, oh, fuck off. Oh, there's a lot of these guys too. Oh my god, there's a lot of these guys. The only thing I haven't found more of are the tel the super keys. The ones that uh the ones that open up those teleporters. I haven't found more of those. As soon as I find one, I'm going over there. They're immune to the lava. Fuck you, man. <laughs> you guys, you know what? Are we going to find a rune that's like the orange charred ring that's going to let me like walk on the stuff? I wonder. I, I wonder if we will. This sword is amazing. This sword is okay. It's not as upgraded as it should be because I've spread my upgrades across like five different weapons. It could be much, much better. Um, I'm gonna fucking die. I'm gonna die to this shit. My armor is amazing. Didn't the beginning have keyholes? Uh, I think it did, yeah. The, somewhere in the first cave. I don't think I've been back to the first cave, though. Yeah, if that meter fills up, I die. If that meter fills up, I die. Okay, what were these horrible enemies guarding? Okay, that's fine. What is the part two of the playthrough coming to YouTube? It's on YouTube right now. It's on YouTube right now. It even has uh, a lovely, lovely thumbnail. <laughs> I'm pretty, I'm pretty proud of today's uh, clickbait thumbnail. Snake ahead. God damn, every, la every long ladder is going to say snake ahead. <laughs> this isn't even that... Oh, how, I was like, this isn't even that long of a ladder. Not even that long of a ladder. When these guys die, they like explode for some reason. Commoner's headband. There actually was a snake. I really wanted to throw that guy into the lava. Any hot anime girls in this game? 
There's a couple of uh, there's a couple of people that will get uh, a couple of characters that were we're pretty much guaranteed are gonna get looted before too long if they haven't already. Uh, the only my as far as I'm concerned, the only waifu for me is Wormface. Get it because he's got worms on his face, dude. He, <laughs> he literally put me right in his. He grabbed me with one of his attacks. We got we got to see it up close and personal. Oh my god. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Things are getting nasty in here. Because we needed a fucking, we needed a, is that his brain? We needed a big brain one too, apparently. <laughs> the big brain one. You can tell he's the big brain one because he's so smart. He's casting spells and shit, right? Uh, where is my thing? Gonna cure my poison and let's uh, cure, let's heal myself too. All right, well, you, you use one, go ahead. Am I gonna need two? Not here and then seek right. Where the fuck am I? Oh my god. Where the hell am I? Oh, wrong thing. <laughs> is this a new build? You already beat the game. No, this isn't a new build. This is a, believe it or not, this is a deck sword. It's not a new build. I'm still mostly decks. Oh, great. Okay, well, at least I didn't die. <laughs> wow. Really great. All right, let's get the fuck out of here. Ah, yeah, ah, yeah, ah. Are we back at the start of this area, maybe? No, because we already were there, right? Where where are we? We are! This is like the beginning area. Isn't it? Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. So that, using that stone key really gave us like a massive shortcut back here. Uh, sure. I think we can level up real quick. There we go. Perfect. Is that a button on the table? I don't think so. Uh, I'm liking getting more endurance. 
It's letting me wield uh, heavier and heavier armor and not have to worry about stuff. Okay, so this is where we just came from. And I think there's more to find here. This has to be one of the most, like, what other games are this, this massive? Like, I'm trying to think of, like, other games that are this massive. God damn it, dude. Breath of the Wild? No. Oh, I, guys, you know, it might be dead. Undertale, Minecraft. When I say massive, I think I'm talking about the content, not like the size. So you guys, people are too obsessed with the size of the world. Like maybe the, maybe the Breath of the Wild world is technically bigger, but it's nowhere near as dense and like intricate as this is. Like nowhere near that. Whatever you may think, maybe Breath of the Wild's world is bigger, but who cares? Uh, I thought this was going to be like an elevator or something. It's powering up. Fucking God. Oh my God. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Deserved. Well, we've got the shortcut right back there. Everything I've ever died to in this game has killed me when it had like one HP left. When do you get all the Korok seeds though? Everything in this game that ever kills me has had one HP left. So I feel like there was something else. There's like other stuff way up top too. Like I feel like there's still more stuff we missed over there. So wait, where? what is the purpose of this little area? Is there something here? Maybe uh, I don't. I don't see what's here. I don't know. <laughs> oh, here it is. Hang on. I think I see it. guy a fucking raise man this guy is working holy shit give that guy a raise man death required ahead hmm required give that guy a fucking raise man no high road ahead ahead seems familiar Where the hell are we going? <laughs> Where the hell are we going? Uh, okay. Hang on. Prison tower, volcano manor, seethe water, terminus, guest hall, 
Temple of A. What's the Temple of Aigle? This game ruined games for me. Nothing is going to be like this again for a long time. This is a game. In my opinion, this is a game that comes around like once every like 20 or 30 years. That's like a game like it like changes video games and it changes shit forever, you know? Okay, so this create is that this is going to create a bridge. Oh, we get a cutscene. Right, like in my lifetime, I feel like games that did that would be like Ocarina of Time, Mario 64, Donkey Kong Country, Super Mario World, Elder Scrolls, Oblivion, Halo, Halo 2, Call of Duty, like Modern Warfare, like, you know, like games that come around like, you know, once in a, in a very, very rare time, you know? How does this game perform on PlayStation 4? I'm, I don't know. I'm actually interested. Yeah. And sometimes some of those games, like, you know, it takes time for them for you to really realize. But yeah, that that's my opinion anyway. God of War. I've never seen Barb so happy since Darkest Dungeon. I love Darkest Dungeon. Okay. So we raised this bridge. Behold. There's a path down there. I'm still not entirely sure where I'm trying to go or what I'm trying to do. Um, can I survive this? I don't think so. I don't think so. I don't think I can. Try jumping. I don't think that's survivable. Okay. Boy, it get fucking dark enough here? Jesus. Um, yeah, I'll use my quote-unquote immunity ring. That'll help. <laughs> okay, we fought you before a lot. So we're back towards the, like, the entrance here. We fought this guy. Oh, man. Is this a good entry for FromSoft games? Uh, this game is going to eat your ass. If this is your first FromSoft game, it's kind of eaten my ass a few times and I have beaten them all without dying and randomizers and, and mods. And it's kind of eaten my ass at a few times. So if you play this, you're going to have your ass eaten. However, if you're up for the challenge, if you're up for it, and you've got the patience and the time. Uh, this is extremely rewarding of a video game to play. It's insanely rewarding and it's so much fun. Well, looks like I'm going down. Oh, you know what this is? I don't know where I am, but that's a fucking Capra demon right there. I don't know where I ended up, but that's totally a Capra demon. Before we fight the Capra demon, Let's try to get our bearings here. See where the fuck we are. Okay, okay. I know. I think I know where we are. This is that we just spent the key here and opened this up, and then we went. Yeah, we went in this room. Uh, let's see what's over here. I mean, in all seriousness, like. This game's difficulty is very negotiable in a way that like Sekiro's is not like much like Dark Souls 1 or, or Bloodborne and Dark Souls 3. If you're if you're hella stuck on something, you can just go somewhere else. And this game, more than any of the other games, gives you a million places to go, a million places to explore. Like you've got a ton of options. You're not required like bash your brains out against this boss for two years and hope you win. Like, you're by no means are you required. If anything, the game tries to actively teach you that when you start it out. Because if you if you go right into Margit, like, Margit is going to fucking annihilate you if you go right into Margit.
I swear, every time they put the Capra Demon dude around, he's always got dogs. I, I feel like I feel like it's a little spiteful. Erd tree seal. Fuck you. Great omen killer cleaver. Hang on. You are such a prick. Sounds like a dagger. Where's it at? Where is it? It's definitely a weapon. I like that God's that God can stabby below the axes below the axes. Oh, here it is. Requires 23 strength. It's a great axe. Neat weapon. It's a halberd. Golden rune. Some real, uh, some real, uh, lower berg vibes here with all the fire and everything. Uh, there are a ton of weapons in this game. Do we? Uh, I, I don't tell Zeus, but uh, we found the Whirly Gig Saw today. <laughs> okay, I don't know where to go. Let's see where to go. This seems like a dead end. Your mom's a halberd? I, I think this might be like a dead end little cul-de-sac here. I didn't mean to fall in here, though. I wasn't trying to. There's an item on this rooftop. I'm telling. I like my. Do you like my chubby characters? I was like, oh, okay. Well, he can't get over here. And then, lo and behold, you all be fine. He can't make it over here. Didn't work out for me. Uh, I missed I got an answer about this dex affect how fast you roll. No, it does not. Your roll is affected by your equip load. So if you were trying to like wear better armor and have a better roll, you would want to level up endurance uh, if you wanted to do that. No ADP shenanigans in this game? Not to my knowledge, no. Thank God for that. Somebody jumped on that chimney. So this is how you grab this item, whatever this item may be. What do we got? Another smithing stone. You know what? I'll take it. Stop throwing poison shit at me. Asshole. Oh, uh, okay.
You had no idea my character looks so disgusting. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Got a headband we can put on. I think the uh, the bowl hat might <laughs> it might it might be technically better. I'm not sure. Okay, I'm totally lost. I'm, I don't know where I am. I don't know where I've been. I don't know where I'm going. It's like I've never been in this area before. I am completely lost. Ah, bleh, ah. Ah, bleh, ah. Mystery Science Theater. Why is it always you don't have the right? Get out of here. Bah. Bleh. Bah. There's a subgenre of hentai called Ugly Bastard. Marvelous make Ugly Bastard protagonists. <laughs> well, as an Ugly Bastard myself, Explosive Great Bolt. I, I think I've like gone in circles in this area multiple times <laughs> and and I still like I'm still finding stuff like I still yeah we've definitely been here before but like I'm still like not sure like there's got to be like another big boss here right Did I perm my hair? Uh, I haven't I haven't done anything with my hair in a while aside from like wash it and pretty much it. Behind the dragon. Oh right, there was the dragon dude we didn't kill. Just cause fighting him in that like kind of corner was really shit. Uh <laughs> oh, excuse me. Oh. What the hell is this guy doing here? <laughs> well, he needed the poop. I gotta say, guys, I'm a little stumped here. I don't think we've completed this area. I'm not sure where we're going. Have I been here? Oh, okay, this is where we fought the dragon, dude. This is where we fought him. Uh, apparently walking in lava is not that bad. Apparently it's not that bad. Uh, also this elevator. I think I know this elevator. I think I know where that takes me. I think the dragon's over there. Okay. 
Yeah, there he is. Fighting this thing is going to be a royal pain in the ass, dude. Man. How the hell are you? How the hell are you supposed to fight this thing here? How the hell are you supposed to fight this thing here? It's not a boss. It's been a boss twice for us before. It's been a boss twice. This time it's just a random NPC, I guess. Maybe it's a good thing we got respawned here. Let's go take... I feel like if, if we're trying to figure out where to go, I think it makes sense to take the shortcut. Let's take the shortcut way up. You have a fire resist charm that... Oh, didn't we? We got another charm. I forgot to look at what it did, right? It said Erd Tree charm. I don't know where it was. I thought we got one. Maybe, I don't know. Boost non-physical damage negation. Raises immunity, raises focus. I'm not sure. It's probably one of these. Anyway, I feel like it makes sense to follow the shortcuts. You know, like, take that shortcut. Take this shortcut. I feel like that makes sense to me. Oh, God! Bird tree seal. Apparently we've never been down here. Uh, let's go down here. Uh, before we keep going up, let's, let's take a look at the bottom here. Missionary's cookbook. Oh... Uh... All right, go. I can't say I really care much for the crafting system yet. Maybe, maybe crafting is dope and I don't realize it. What weapon is this? Uh, this is God. This is Morgoth's Cursed Sword plus seven. I haven't really seen anything that I really want to craft. Oh, okay, so we could have taken this ladder the entire time. Could have done that literally the entire time. It's the Walmart Mortal, Mortal Blade. <laughs> okay, let's keep heading this way. Uh, have we been down here?
Be wary of tears. Suffering. Oh, yeah, we, we went under. We went under all this before. Out. Okay, let's go back. Let's go back up here. I have a Deathly Hallows cape. I've got a Three Musketeers cape. What do you mean? This whole game is suffering? Uh, I don't think so. I think this game is amazing. There's been some occasional moments of salt. I think the most salt was probably against the boss that had all the skeletons in the room with him. The giant dragon guy, that guy, there was definitely some salt versus him. Uh, okay, we were here before too. And yesterday against Moog, I, had, I definitely had some salt against Moog. I think I was insanely underpowered for Moog. Oh, shit. All right. Fucking beam me up, bitch. 